we find a cross or what? Did we find Jesus? <laughs> it's safe to say we found Jesus, y'all. Welcome back to part two of last week's video, family. I'm Drake. I'm Diamond, aka Lawn Bay. And you're watching Drake, Drake Lawn, Lawn Care. Care. In today's video, we're gonna be tackling a huge backyard. Huge. Some of you may remember this yard from last week's episode. The next door neighbor reached out to us in desperate need of help. She mentioned that the homeowner passed away a few years ago, and ever since then, the home has been vacant. Now, the home was left to their children, and they kept it up for a while. But after some time, the home began to look neglected. Out of respect for her deceased neighbor, she did not wish to report this home to code enforcement. So she called us instead. I definitely understood her hesitation to report this line and felt the need to help. We did get a chance to meet the neighbor and she was so excited and thankful for our help. So shout out to you. We hope you all enjoy this cleanup as much as we do. And remember, an act of kindness a day keeps the stress away. Now enough talk, it's time to sit back, relax, and, and enjoy, enjoy the, the show. show.
side note so it's a fence tangled and all that i thought it was a shrub but it's literally just a fence balled up inside of there giving the uh the perception of a shrub that's crazy nature is crazy let's get back into it <laughs> All right, y'all. So, as you can see, I got to squat down because that was a lot of work. That fence was buried in there, creating an illusion that that was a shrub, but it was not a shrub. I'm glad that we had our boat cutters with us because, man, that was tough. I mean, it was three fence wrapped inside of each other simultaneously, you know, intertwined, whatever you want to call it. So, yep, we got it out. Thanks to Lon Bay. You know, she was doing her work. Thanks, Moved that big old brick. It was kind of put a force on it as well. So, yeah, we got that out. Let's get back to it.
said we got the first three gates out but we got one more to do and this is taking a little bit long so we're gonna go ahead and wrap this up right about now voila just like that we got the fence out me and lb give me some <laughs> man that was the hardest part of this whole entire yard i mean the front yard included was getting that fence out of the ground we did it we're gonna wrap up we're gonna clean this little part up right here and then we're gonna get back some more so let's go Okay, you all, so right here, this part as you see I'm pulling, this is actually uh, tied into another gate. That gate is not gonna be able to come out. I don't have a chainsaw, so those are all the posts and it's connected to the neighbor fence. So I don't wanna pull on that too much because it's intertwined with that fence, which is the neighbor fence and I'm not trying to pull that out. So I'm gonna try to cut a line right here to divide it. And it might be snakes in here as well because I see this like, it look like a den area, so. Yeah, we just gonna make sure we just, you know, try to even this up and we'll leave that alone because I don't want her fans to come down. Let's get back to it. Or what? Did we find Jesus? <laughs> it's safe to say we found Jesus, y'all. Hey, this deserves a thumbs up. <laughs> <laughs>
Thank you.